Hello Travelers, today we're taking a look at the Baton 3, which is a rechargeable 1200 lumen LED flashlight from a company called Olight. I was provided this sample for review, but this is an independent review. Also, Olight is having a flash sale starting today and going until the end of September, so be sure to check out the links in the description for the sale prices. There is also a code in the description for when the sale is over, or for non-sale items to get 10% off. When I first saw this product picture, I thought it was some kind of flask or bottle, but when you look closer, you can see there's actually a battery case which magnetically attaches to your Baton 3 inside and charges it for up to an additional 3.7 times. The Baton 3 comes in three colors, black, red, which I have here, and an orange. To get a few more specs out of the way, it's 1200 lumens, has a throw of 166 meters, and a magnet on the end which allows it to attach to metal surfaces. It has a total of three brightness settings in addition to a strobe mode, and it's worth noting that it only gives you quick access to the low, medium, and high settings with regular button presses. The moonlight, which is the lowest setting, and the turbo, which is the brightest, require long presses, and the strobe requires a triple press. The lowest setting is 0.5 lumens and lasts for up to 20 days. Low is 12 lumens and lasts for up to 33 hours. Medium is 60 lumens and goes for 7.5 hours. And high is 300 lumens for 95 minutes. The turbo mode, which is 1200 lumens, goes for 1.5 minutes and then drops to 300 lumens for the, an additional 75 minutes. To me, one of the attractive features of all Olight flashlight designs is this universal clip that they use. It allows the light to be clipped facing forwards or backwards. It's kind of a universal two-way clip. This means that you can attach it to the peak of your cap and use it as a makeshift headlamp or to the corner of your pants or jacket to illuminate your path. I found the texture on the side to be very easy to grip and it does feel very comfortable when you're holding it. The button to turn the light on and off is on the side and I found myself taking a few extra seconds to turn it on and off because I got so used to flashlights with a button on the rear rather than on the side. But it does have a very nice click and works very well. Finally the case and the color are really great and I like these colors. Uh, they feel very well made, but I can see how it might be a bit bulky for everyday carry. Luckily, they do sell a separate smaller charger, which you can connect to the rear of this and magnetically and wirelessly charge it, separate from this charging bank, if you did want an overall smaller way of charging it. Overall, it's a really great flashlight and it has a lot of features and it feels very well made, very durable, and will definitely last for a very long time. Do be sure to check out the links in the description for the sale prices and be sure to stay subscribed to keep up to date with the future videos.